Hello, internets. It is currently Tuesday morning. Uh, intro of darkness. 7.54 a.m. 5 a.m. I'm a little hungry, and I'm going to make something, again, rather unconventional. I just want something simple, so I'm going to rock some Mr. Noodles. Now, there's a YouTuber out there named Why Traffic Why, and he showed uh, a video on how to cook noodles using the stove top. You know what? That's a good freaking idea because then you don't get the microwave soggies. So I'm gonna try that now. So I got my pot going here. I'm gonna throw my two cups of water in it that it recommends. I'm gonna follow his directions to a T and we'll see how this turns out. So right now we just gotta bring the water to a boil. So let's go with that. Let me just leave that like that and see what he does. No. There goes the Phoenix, having his breakfast. Check it out, why traffic, why? My stove has underglow too, even though it's an old archaic stove. The water's pretty much boiling now. So, we will grab our noodles and our soup base and just pitch them in the water. And then we have to open the soup base. Now the ingredients or the directions on the package does not call for putting the soup base in the water but it's been proven that it gives it more flavor so in this day and age flavor is everything I'm gonna turn down the heat all right I'll come back to this all right so the ramen noodles are completed I also made some toast over here with some uh, butter on it but after searching in the cupboard I found some of this crap I don't know how good it is I've never had it before the girlfriend bought it so Apparently it cooks in the microwave in 15 seconds, so that's pretty intense. So I think I'm going to cook a couple slices of this guy and make it be a bacon sandwich or something. Well, that's some very interesting bacon. Apparently it only takes like 5 seconds in the microwave, so let's give that a try. Come over here to the microwave, open the door, plop in the bacon, close the door. 10 seconds. Watch it spin. Can't spin. And it's bacon. Look at that. That was the quickest cooking bacon ever in the world. Well, at least it smells like bacon. We'll give it a taste test there once it's on the sandwich. Anybody out there ever had this crap before? Is it any good? <laughs> Leave a comment. Alright, BLT. Sweet. So we will install the top layer of bread and give it the old Frenchman cut. Voila! BLT ramen noodles. Breakfast of champions. All right, so it's om nom time. I like om nom time. Breakfast is done. That was actually really good. Traffic or why traffic? Why? I've never made noodles in the stove on the stove top before, and that turned out really awesome. <coughs> Oh, as you can tell, Jesus. So, uh, anybody out there who likes those Mr. Noodles or even the no-name ones would probably taste a hell of a lot better on the stovetop, give that a try. It's actually really good. So, yeah, I'm going to carry on with my day, and I'll film if anything cool happens. Well, I'm freaking bored. Let's, uh, let's try an experiment. You guys all seen that thing on YouTube where they uh, take a cup of water, go outside into the bitter cold, pitch it into the air, and it turns to snow. Let's see if we can replicate that. So we're going to do ourselves a favor, we're going to get that water piping hot and then take her outside to see how well it works. Should be interesting. Okay, so we have our cup of hot water and let's see if this works. Sweet. Just catch all that that's awesome so it actually does work who knew you guys want to see a pomeranian go friggin nuts oreo come here sit hey go time go go time go go time go go time go go time yeah is that a yeah well, let me get my coat on because yours is already built in. Good sign! Want good sign? Yeah? The dribbling puppy.
Okay. Let's go side. Sit. Down. Stay. I'm watching you. Stay down. Stay. Still down? Ha. Ah. Down. Get back. Sit. Stay. Go. He sort of listens. He's just really excited. Excited puppy dog. Well, I'm gonna have a smoke. Pipe. Well, I figured I'd better do the dishes because we got a lot in here and I'm sick and tired of looking at them. So let's get that done. Best invention ever. It's basically just um, a scrub brush where you put soap in the handle. So when you're washing your dishes, it automatically applies soap to your dishes. Pretty sweet. Well, let's super time lapse this. Don't have all day. done the dishes so that's one less thing to do on the uh one less thing to do on the to-do list just got to go do some groceries which i think the girlfriend's doing after uh work and then we're ready to rock got a couple things to throw out like can over there can over there but other than that we're good to go for the rest of the day sweet so i'll just let this drip dry and she can put them away tonight when she gets home from work i made myself a coffee so i'm gonna go drink this relax for the rest of the day thinking about going to the mall after i don't know why but thinking about it it's about one o'clock now so i might go to the mall after or just go to the grocery store and pick something up for my lunch guys we're all out of lunch meat so that kind of sucks maybe if i'm nice enough i'll tell the girlfriend to get me some roast beef for uh lunch meat because i love me roast beef sandwiches they gotta be the best anywho i'll check in if something cool happens uh, well guys i frigged up again today no i didn't fall back asleep what happened was i got this new game uh fallout new vegas I guess it's not really that new it's been out for a while i'm thinking anyway it's uh kind of like the fallout 3 and you know how those time vampire games are you start playing them and then you lose track of time and next thing you know it's 20 after 3 and you got to get to work so i still got to stop off at the gas station and fill up the g6 or at least put some gas in it because i'm sitting at about an eighth of a tank and that won't get me too far not in this cold so i'm gonna do myself a favor and head out now so i can hit up the gas station drop about 20 bucks in her just to get me going and then get to work i'll keep you guys updated i'll even show you the drive now like i said not a lot of gas in her but uh we'll go drop 20 bucks in it and it should be okay god she likes to rev when she's cold intro of darkness then redness then whiteness station and my low fuel light just came on so that's not a good sign so i'm gonna go load her up well that's what 20 bucks gets you almost a half a tank for the fuel range of 189 kilometers let's get to work Well, as you all know, I'm at work right now. And I got notified that, remember I was talking about the internet caps yesterday? Well, they go live March 1st, which means we're going to have a lot of pissed off customers March 2nd when they find out about it. Probably find out sooner, but... Oh, frig. It's going to make a lot of people very angry. Problem is, we don't have a method to monitor the caps. So that's going to create even more problems. Oh well, we'll figure it out. Well guys, I'm on lunch. Adrian's supposed to be bringing me a coffee, so I think that's him right there in the pickup truck. Kicking her sideways. Right there in the pickup truck. Kicking her sideways. Oh. 
<laughs> almost banged her. <laughs> oh well. Almost, but not quite. Let's see what kind of hijinks we can get going for you guys tonight. Holy crap, guys. It's freezing out. I don't even know what the temperature is. It's like minus something ridiculous, but uh, Adrian's here. Hi! <laughs> you brought the fuvas. Fuvas. But we're just chatting, freezing our ball bags off, and yeah, good times. Okay, I'm gonna go soon. <laughs> yeah, good call. Camera's shaking, guys, because I'm shaking. All right, I'm gonna turn this off because my hand's freezing. It's 11 o'clock at night and I super forgot to come out for break. <laughs> Got about an hour to go and then it's home time and I guess it's time to edit the video and get her ready for deployment. Sweet. Oh, it's so cold out tonight. Check the temperature. And down at this end of town, it's minus 24 right now. Tomorrow's payday, so that's sweet. I like money. I like money. So, I guess I'll smoke this cigarette and then I'll go back in. Just take the next 45 minutes of work and then go home. Sweet. Well, work shift is done. Time to go home. Holy friggin, I am tired. Then again, I've been up since like early this morning. So like 8 o'clock this morning. So what do you expect, right? Uh, I'm running 14 hours now. Does that sound right? No, I'm more than that. Way more than that. 16 hours. So I'm going to go home, edit this video, call her a night. So it's rock and roll. So that's a bonus. So I'm gonna edit this video, toss her up on the YouTubes. Or I might do that tomorrow, I'm not sure, but I'm gonna edit it tonight. Yeah, I'm heading to bed, I'm tired. I got a busy day tomorrow. I gotta go and do my passport thing because we're going to Mexico in March, March 17th to be precise. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be crazy. So I gotta make sure my passport's in and I'm ready to rock for that. So tomorrow we'll be doing some driving around. So if you enjoyed this film, Go ahead and hit the like button. If you got something to comment on, you know where the comment section is. It's down below. Go ahead and hit it. What else can I say? There's not much else to say. So until next time, guys, keep on vlogging.